Hey guys, it's Dirty here, and I got a little location guide for you guys. We're on the map Hunter's Grotto, and we're going to be finding the four totem pole locations. These totem poles are used to spawn Dexy Duos the Invincible, and I'm going to show you the locations on the map and where they physically are for all four of the totem poles. Um, and then I'll show you where to uh, get the lever to spawn Dexy Duos. And because the lever, once you use all totem poles, <coughs> there's like a summoning place. That summoning place is uh, out, basically out in the open, and there's a little four lights on it. Each light indicates you've uh, paid the fire place, I'll, I'll call it, or the sacrifice, whatever you want to call it. Um, and each of the poles, as you pay them, the light will come on, or flame. And then once you've got all four, you can pull the lever and he'll spawn. He doesn't spawn immediately, a couple of waves of enemies come before he will spawn, and then he spawns. So yeah. This is the second one coming up. You can see it's just ahead. And I was doing this with a friend so that we could split the costs, so I would buy the first two, he would buy the second two. So it only cost us about 50 Iridian each. Roughly. And it was like 48 or something, it was close. <coughs> Here's the uh, third one, right on the water's edge. So you just grab a vehicle, it's really out in the open, it's really not that hard to find. The hardest one to find, of course, is the fourth one. Now the fourth one <coughs> that I'm showing you is not necessarily the fourth one. You can get them in any order you want, but the fourth one I'm showing you is the hardest one to find as it's on top of a mountain. So you have to start on the ground near the area where you're actually going to spawn him. And you're going to want to open up this gate. We're then going to go up an elevator, turn around, and run. And I wasn't just going to show you me being on top because a lot of people would be confused. So I'm going to show you the whole part. So this is why it's going to be like a minute and a half long just for this one totem pole because I want to show you how I get there. So you're basically running straight ahead. You can pick up eggs if you want to. It's completely up to you. But we're going to hit the elevator, take it to the top. And then once we hit the top, we're going to be running straight ahead through this path you can see. There's a big open door we're going to hit through, head through, sorry. I'm basically going to be running s roughly straight, straight to the left basically. And then we're going to run past a house, or in between a couple of slots. There's going to be two witches at a little hut just near the edge of the mountain. And then um, once you kill those witches, you can get the totem pole. You can get the, obviously get the totem pole before you kill the witches, but the witches in this game are really annoying, and you might want to kill them. So, probably want to do that before you go ahead and buy the totem pole, otherwise yeah. you die and it takes another couple minutes to spawn and get back up top here, so. This is the house I was talking about that we're going to be running past. These are the, I'll call them, sheets of metal. We're going to be running past those and running towards this little hut. You can see the totem pole is up ahead. And one which is going to spawn out the front, one's going to spawn out at the back. Oh, both have to And then we're going to buy this one. This, of course, is the last one. And then I'll show you guys where the switch is. So here we are at the switch. In still in Hunter's Grotto, you can see all the things are alight. And we're going to pull the lever. And that's how you spawn him. 